Really nice out tonight. Yeah. Look, Cora, I've been wanting to say this to you for a while now. Oh, look, isn't that tree really? I love you. <coughs> oh. Obviously, if she didn't return his feelings, she shouldn't have felt obligated to say anything. She pushed him away. She drove him into breaking up with her. And now, he's probably moved on with a new girlfriend who sees how amazing he is and will never you think have no evidence. evidence. That's how little she met. This is pure yeah. conjecture. He's the only person who understood her, who accepted her, who loved, loved her. And you'll, he's moved on now. And she's gonna die alone and sad. <laughs> now wait a second, that was completely uncalled for. She's weak, she's worth it, she's so fun. That's not true, that's how it's true. You never cared about her. They always wanted her to relate to you. They 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 wanted her to relate to March 30th. So, how long have you been waiting here? About 10 minutes. I'm late to class for sure. Oh, that sucks. How about you? Where are you headed? I'm just getting lunch with a friend, but I got plenty of time. Lucky. Oh. I'm Aaron, by the way. I'm Cora. Nice to meet you. April 23rd. I cannot believe this weekend passed by so quickly. How was it? It was really fun. Uh, me and my friends went on a camping trip in Livermore, I think? Hey, I'm from there. What a coincidence. Maybe you passed by my house. Maybe. It's really nice up there. How about you? How was your day? I got lunch with my roommate. We went to this new place that opened up on Central. Pretty good food. And the owner was so nice. We should go together sometime. July 2nd. Hey, Cora, I just saw the ugliest looking dog outside here. Cora? Hey. What's wrong? It's nothing. I think I know you well enough to know when something's up. Really? I'm fine. Come on. People always say they're fine when they usually don't mean it. No. No. You know what? I think I'm late for class. Hey! Aaron, what are you? You can talk to me. It's not a big deal. Here. What's this? Your math midterm? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I just got it back and, and I failed it. I thought I did better than that. It's okay, it's just one midterm. No, it's not. I put so much effort into studying for it. I just I just You can't tell me, Cora. I've never failed a test before. What will my parents think when they find out about it? They want me to become a doctor, and I can't get into med school if I fail a test. I don't want to disappoint them, and I feel like, I feel like I'm a failure. Cora, relax. Come on. Sit down, okay? Don't worry. You're not a failure. So you failed the midterm. So what? That's not going to determine your future. I mean, you have plenty more tests, right? So you'll do better on those. I'll even help you study if you want. You're going to be fine. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm not usually like this. I hate being so... so... you know. It's okay. I'm your boyfriend. You can tell me these kinds of things. October 17. The 
that are taking over me. Aaron? Happy birthday, Cora. I... I can't believe you did all this. Of course. Why wouldn't I go all out for someone I love? Thanks. Really. I love you. I'm sorry. I can't. Not now. Then when? What? You want me to say here in front of everyone? I didn't say anything about now. You're the one making it more complicated than it should be. Can you just let it go, please? It's my birthday. No, no, I don't understand why you refuse to talk about this. I mean, anytime it comes up, you can never say it. I'm starting to wonder if you even feel the same way. I said let it go. I'm not going to fight with you in front of my friends. Fine. <clears throat> December 2nd. It's not a big deal. I told you I'd help you study tomorrow, okay? But you promised you'd help me study today. I don't have time tomorrow. And look, all you're playing is all you're doing is playing video games. Well just study now then. <sighs> it's too late now. I'm just gonna go sleep. I have an 8 a.m. tomorrow. What? You should have told me that earlier. I did, but you weren't listening. Are you seriously mad at me again? I'm sick of fighting with you, Cora. I mean, you get upset over the most minor things, and when I try talking to you about it, you always change the subject. No, I don't. I'm not mad. I'm just... Cora. I don't think I can do this anymore. What? What are you saying? I mean, honestly, Cora, are we even having fun? It's like we're always upset at each other. I mean, I love you, but... You always get like this and sometimes I feel like you don't feel the same way about me. Do you? I think we should break up. Wait, Aaron, I do care about you. Why don't you say it? Why can't you just believe me? I don't have any trouble saying it and if you really loved me, you wouldn't either. Well, maybe I'm not like you. I think you're right. What'd you say? I said, I think you're right. That this isn't working out. So you're saying? We, we should break up. Cora, are you? Are you sure? Yes! It was your idea in the first place! I know, but... No, no. It's fine. It's over. Wait, Aaron, I... I want to stay friends. <laughs> 